All right, let's say you're running a back test and you keep getting an error, like an on init error, okay? In other words, the EA doesn't actually load and the back test never runs. And let me give you an example. Let me, let me start to run a back test. You can see I've got a file loaded here, CSV file that's been scraped from uh, the back tester. And I'm going to run a test. But what happens? Nothing, nothing happens actually. It doesn't load. And we get these kinds of errors in the journal of the back test. We've got a global initialization failed, a critical error, expert initialization failed because the expert is not loading. Some brokers will report this as an on init error. Okay. So you've got this attached to a chart, right? You've got your ID, you've got algo trading enabled, you've got DLL imports enabled, okay? But it still doesn't work. Why? And that is because the DLL sharing functionality here on the back tester is not the same as it is here on the testing environment, okay? So we have to actually enable it here in options. Okay, once you do that, then it's going to run. So let's go ahead and start. And you can see it starts. All right, pretty soon it's going to start populating the trade history. It does take a little while. I'm not going to run the whole two week test, but I just want to show you that it that it does actually function. Okay, so let's give it a little bit. And we'll see that the test will start to populate the trade history. And there we go. So that solves that problem.